You see why DNA is very important. DNA test is very, very important when you are sensing trouble. When there is a doubt between a couple, DNA is very important. When there is a controversy between a child, DNA is very, very important. My people, this is SDOJ Family Fun Page bringing a message of truth to you. Please share this video as you are watching it. Keep sharing this video. Women, what is your problem? If you know that that man you have promised marriage, that man you accepted proposal to marry, that man you married, you accepted to come to your father's house to pay your diary, you don't love him. Please go. Please leave. Please return the bride price. That will be the best for you. How can a woman accept a man into her life as her husband? The man married you traditionally, legally, even do white wedding in the church. And you keep cheating on him. If you know you cannot control your urge, please, Make sure wherever your husband go, you follow him. This is an advice to you married woman that has a high libido, a high sexual libido. If you know you cannot control your urge, if you have uncontrollable, if you have uncontrollable sexual urge, please listen. Anywhere your husband go, you know that he will not come back that day. Follow him. How can a married woman, fully married, living with her husband, just that, within an interval of days or weeks, your husband travel. You went and meet and sleep with your husband best friend your husband best friend and the man gave you belly you carry belly for your husband best friend and you give birth to twins this man has been taking care of these twins the second belly again you still went and meet your husband, the same man, your husband's best friend, and carry the second belly. Uh -uh. Do you have conscience at all? Do you have conscience? How will you feel seeing that man loving those kids that he is not the father? Spending on them, taking care of them. How do you feel? We told that he is the biological father of those children. The first was twins. The second one, nobody knows what the baby may be. You are still pregnant. Newly pregnant. Still, the same man. Oh, women have conscience now. Nah. Have conscience. Have conscience. The man is out there struggling to make a living. The man is out there working to see that he put food on your table. He take care of you. He bring money to you. And you are there messing up. You can imagine that. To this day now you make the same man that gave you the belly. Use it as a joke to be... Cracking joke on your husband that made him to see to the end of it. You can imagine that. You did the first one. Let's say maybe it's a mistake. A very expensive mistake. Why the second one? Now the man is using it to talk to your husband. Making jest of him. That made him to say, no, I have to do DNA on these children. 
as he's buying baby things for the unborn child, he took the children to the hospital for DNA. He returned the children the next day as the wife told him we need bath, the bath has broken. The man went to the market and got the bath. Then going to hospital co to collect the results, he became disappointed. Coming home to see to the father of the children, to surprise the wife, all he could go to was, my dear, is, is really painful. It's really painful. A lady you married and you have been taking care of this lady, you make sure that she lacks nothing. You supply all she needs. All you could get from her was betrayal. Yes, she did not deny it. Immediately she saw the DNA report. She did not deny all she could say. Sorry, 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 sorry. Sorry cannot solve it. Sorry cannot reverse it. And that same person that made just of that man is the father of those children. And she even confessed, even the unborn child, the pregnant, the belly that she carried. The lady confessed, even the belly that she carried is still for the man. Because you don't, you know the quick come. You don't come quickly. You don't come on time. You are not, you're not around. Is that an excuse? That is not an, enough excuse for you to mess up with your husband friend. Can't you control yourself? My people share this video. This is this is really painful for me to speak about this. It's really painful because I know that you as a lady can control it. You can control what comes inside you and what goes out of you. And as a married woman, you have no right to sleep with any other person except your husband. Because you're doing that not only matter of bearing babies for that person. You are bringing cause upon your husband, upon your home, even upon the child. Share this video. This got to stop. If you are a married woman and you are still sleeping with your husband's friend, please stop it. One day, truth must surface. Share this video. God bless you all.